Alright, what's up guys? It's your boy Rashad. And I'm coming with a Marvel for 2 commentary. It's been a while since I've done one. But I got some Team Deathmatch here on Favela. And the setup I'm going to be using today is the M4A1 with the USP 45 as my secondary. And my perks are Slide of Hand Pro, Stopping Power Pro, and Steady Aim. And this is on a new account that I made on Xbox Live. So. I don't, I don't have any guns really, and I'm basically, I think I was like level 5 or something in this game. But, anyways, I have a, another, well I have a special guest with me. He's going to be doing some commentary with me on this one, and getting his input on Call of Duty and all that good stuff. So, why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself. Alright, um, my name is Xavier, I'm Rashad's brother. I mean, we've already made a video, but never on Modern Warfare 2. And, of course, this is on my Xbox 360. And, yeah, he made him a new account and all. I'm currently using his account, Keys18, so anybody want to play again? Well, okay, we only have seven minutes, so you don't need to tell everybody that. But, anyways, um, I'm basically here, you know, I'd say Favela is probably my favorite map out of all. Uh, favela and probably Skid Row. What's your favorite? Uh, I go. I had to go with High Rise. That's one of my favorite ones. Well, I mean, I mean, High Rise is good if you. I don't know. I don't know. It's just like there's nothing there. I mean, all the people do is like throw grenade launchers across the map. That's basically most of the kills when you play on High Rise. I don't particularly like that map. I mean. I can do I can score get a pretty good score on the map every time I play but overall I, I wouldn't pick that map to you know to play on well that one and high rise and sub base is one of my, my favorite ones the sub base I get like uh, 20 kills like every time I play 20 plus right uh, well I don't know I probably had to stick with uh, just favela and skid row well, Favela, I mean, it can, it does have its down points because people usually like to go on top of these buildings and uh, pick people off. But you have to be careful, like especially like around corners and um, checking, you know, like buildings and all that type of stuff because you can't get picked off and killed easily that way. So, and then with Skid Row, um, it's not really, I mean, it's more, it's more actions based off um, actions like in the buildings and stuff like that. So. Um, it's not really very open space like all the other maps, but I'd say my two favorite are Favela and Skid Row. So, um, yeah, what, what's your least favorite? Uh, I had to say this one because every time I turn around, somebody's either right behind me to either knife me, snipe me, or put a shotgun shell inside of me. So I really don't like Favela. Oh, unless, well. I'm, unless I'm playing with one of my friends. That's, that's it. Oh well, I'd say my least favorite would have to be probably derailed because that it's just like a boring map. I mean, it's so big. Like, I mean, you, I play domination, which is uh, I play a, a domination which is six v six. I play regular domination, and that map is like so boring. I mean, when you play like TDM and regular domination on Wasteland, I mean that. I mean, Wasteland has more action than derail does, and they're just about as big like I mean uh what am I trying to say here I mean they're both big but I had to say derail is bigger but wasteland has more action on it than derail does it just an all all around boring map I can't basically I really don't know what map you're talking about because I can't really remember derail derail with all the train tracks I mean well not train tracks the trains you know they're like off road oh yeah I know it's snowy yeah, I don't know what you're talking about, but yeah, high rise and sub base have to be my top. Two, have to be my tops. And then your least favorite is this one that you're playing on now. Favela. Oh uh, well, my least favorite would have to be Wasteland. I mean, not Wasteland. Derail and Rust. I don't know why they put Rust in there. I mean, it's just a stupid. Cause all people do, like, not everyone's gonna do good. Probably one person who. When you play like TDM or something, that's gonna get a good KD on. When you play on Rust, I don't even know why they put that in the playlist. 
But Rust is best for to me. It's only good for like free for all. Yeah, team death yeah. once, you know. I, I don't really prefer that. I wouldn't say it was good for free for all. I mean, I don't know what it probably is, but I don't know. I mean, only one person probably when you play free for all on Rust will you know get a kill streak going and whatnot. So I I don't particularly like to play free for all anyway. So I wouldn't know. That's just my opinion. I'm only playing free for all about, you know, I'd say, five times, maybe. It was, I was looking for that. I found one spot where nobody could find me. I'm not saying I was camping, but, I mean, I was right there in the open. But they just couldn't see me, I guess. Well, I mean, I wouldn't call it, you know, how were you playing? Like, were, were you at a spot and people kept coming back and you just kept picking them off or whatever? No, they they never kept coming back because like like you know how when you respawn and all you can see the kill cam. Yeah. Well, like I come out of the zoom I was in and then I move to another uh, another spot and then I go right back to it. So. They, oh yeah. They think I, they think that I that's would. not camping. I mean, uh, like some people mistake like playing like smart with camping. They'll say if you like stay in one spot. You know what I mean, that's camping, but I mean, if you know, like, the enemy is gonna keep coming back and trying to pick you off, I mean, I don't know. I, I, I mean, there's a difference when playing smart and playing, you know, I mean, uh, camping, so I mean. Well, you see, you just. Not to get off the subject, but you see how you just upgraded to private first class. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm getting up there. I'm gonna be, uh, you know, since my PS3 is broke. I'm gonna try to get up to where my I was on my uh my PS3 account. I was like level 70 first prestige. I had all my guns. Now I gotta work my way back up. I'm I'm really surprised that you haven't asked me what was my favorite weapon. But oh since, yeah, yeah. What's 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 your favorite weapon? Well, I just unlocked it, but so far I have to say my favorite weapon is the uh, ACR. Do you like it just because of the the no recoil that it has? No, I just like all the, I just like all the, it's the firepower that it has to it. I mean, I get mainly most of my kids. See, at first the M4 was my favorite weapon until, until I locked the ACR. So yeah, the ACR is my, my favorite weapon. And my sidearm, or I mean, my secondary weapon has to be the shotgun. The Spaz 12. Yeah, that has been the well, all right, guys. I hope you enjoyed this dual commentary. Rate the video whatever you think it deserves. Leave some comments and subscribe. Till next time, I'll catch you all later. Peace.